Hey guys, welcome back, and it's Rico here, as you can see. And this is for all of you guys who are looking for a job. And if you haven't seen our, I mean, my last two videos, you guys should check that out. I'm gonna put those two in the description box down below. But first, I want you to hit that subscribe button right here. Then I'm gonna talk about a couple of questions you guys have asked because I have a couple of comments, you know, just what people have been asking and I'm just going to sit here and answer you guys questions. So the first question is going to be, do you get eight hours in Coca-Cola and what is the name of the position pretty much? Well, the name of the title is pretty much book merchandiser as you can see in one of my videos um i do work more than eight hours um, full-time people get to work well they're on a day salary pretty much so you will work more than eight hours more pre pretty much the job is 10 to 15 hours but i, I don't work 15 hours <laughs> you know i work 10 hours that's that's about it for me and the job itself you have to you have to pretty much do everything yourself and how you want it and if you work ahead like say today you will have to plan and do stuff today for tomorrow to set yourself up so it'll make your day a lot easier and make it more easy for you so let me go to the next question how educated do you have to be to get an employee to be an employee as a merchandise? Well, he doesn't really have to have merchant. I mean, you, don't, you really don't have to be educated because all you really need is a high school diploma, or you can know somebody, um, or you can just work. You got a good work background experience because. I had good experience with different jobs I worked at before I worked at Coke. Um, I know some some positions you do you do have to um, have you know maybe a bachelor's or something or I don't know. You can move up in the company as well as you you know you, you get in there, but you have to be a really good worker to move up. Yeah. Now on to my next question. What, what is the starting pay out in my area? Well, the starting pay is different in everybody area. I'm not sure, you know, it's pretty much, it go based on, um, you know, the cost of living because, you know, I'm from North Carolina. I'm sure if I would've went to Cal California, you know, <laughs> you would get paid a lot more than here because the cost of living is, you know, a lot of people with millionaires work out there, so the cost of them is a lot more than here in North Carolina. Um, that would be about it. That's, that's about it. <laughs> the next question is, do I work nighttime at Coca-Cola? Nah, I don't work nighttime. <laughs> I don't work nighttime because I work, I start at six in the morning and I'm not working all the way to the night, but we have guys who work night, maybe like a part-timer that comes in. I know for our branch, we don't, we don't have like guys working all night. We have guys, we might have three part-timers out, you know, pulling stores in the afternoon every now and then. But far as you know, full time our full time guys in our areas, we work pretty much six to five, pretty much. Um, you know, different different areas and branches sales are higher and some may be lower. It just depends on where you are at. My last question I have: explaining the malice reimbursement. Um, if you guys don't know. Coca-Cola does not have company cars. 
So in my position that I am a merchandiser, we drive our own cars and pretty much they reimburse, reimburse you for your mileage, you know, or we use, they use, I'm not sure, different mileage companies that's out there. You know, we get paid once a month and they calculate it off I don't know a percentage or cent. I don't know how it works, but it's you know it track. They track your miles because you have a you know they give you a work phone and it pretty much track your mileage everywhere you go on your work day. Um, mileage check. It's it all depends on how far you drive. You know, some people may drive far, some people may not, but it just all depends on your route um that's all the questions but i'm still going to talk because there is still a couple questions that i know that some people have asked and i have answered them but i know there's one that's like um how hard is the job or you know some people may not like the job it all depends on the person because every job isn't for everybody. For me, my job, I'm not a complainer. I will get it done. I don't care. I don't care how. I, <laughs> I don't care how long it takes. I'm gonna get it done. But at the end of the day, I know um, I'm, I'm gonna be all right. But I always have a plan for the next day, and I know what I'm pretty much going for in the future. So I don't try to complain about how I work and stuff. But I know some people, you know, they say it's a hard job. It is a hard job, but you know, you can make it, you can make it easier. You just have to, you know, communicate with people, pretty people because you know, in this job, you, you're pretty much on your own unless somebody's coming to help you. So you have to communicate with the store managers, the um, DSD receivers, they are the people you talk to to, you know, help you get product on floors and pretty much what's going on throughout the week because each week, each week is different because of the sales that's going on. Um, I believe that's about it that I have. I do if you haven't seen my last two videos you guys should check it out I'm pretty much showing you the job on how to do the job um I hope you guys like this video and don't forget to comment in below on some things I may have missed or you guys like for me to answer as well um I will be doing another coat video not sure on what but you guys should comment down below on what video I should do next Maybe I should try some products or talk about some products, you know, but, you know, comment down below and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and share this video with somebody who may want to work at Coke or who's interested or knowing about Coke. And that is it for this video. <laughs>